Welcome back to my channel. Let's play some cyberpunk. Heard the EMPs were knocking AVs out of the sky. The CPD says the blackout led to 120 mil in damages all in all. The real tragedy though? I can't stomach a cold burrito. Yeah, yeah. 120 million Eddie? Claire, you coming? I'm already here. Great. Be there in a flash, promise. Right on. See you soon. Wait, hold up. Which trigger we using? Yours. Okay. Beast's ready to roar. Be right over. Later. Claire, are you coming? I'm already here. Great. Be there in a flash, promise. Right on. See you soon. Wait, hold up. Which trigger are we using? Yours. Okay. Beast's ready to roar. Be right over. Later. I bet a bundle on a win. Hello? Losing's You're just not an option, eh? What? Hey, look, oh, no. Samson. Fresh meat. Hmm. <laughs> Be embarrassing to lose to a rookie. Chill. Gunk will probably crash out on the first We're at home here. Me. Hey, V. Good to see you. So how's it look to you? Seems to be a lot of corpos taking part. How can you tell? Used to be one. Letting off steam after hours was key. It was either that or stress, burnout, and a trip in a trauma team ambulance. People don't have heart attacks on the circuit, but the ambulances come in handy. Any tips before we roll? Don't take your foot off the chew. My job will be to slow everyone else down. Ultimately, it'll be speed, not firepower, that'll win us this race. Go fast. Got it. Oh, take the shard. I never noticed she had a cross. We need to hit all the checkpoints or we'll be disqualified. If you want to hang a bit, do. I'll be in the rig. When do we start? The shard. It's all on there. with that.
Incoming. Hold on. Oh. Ah, uh, see, that's the cannon. I, but I don't think it'll let me lose. Heads up, Carl. Good luck with that. Let you lose. Fuck. Let's hold up at the finish line a minute, just in case. You got it. Mm. Hey, what gives? Ah! You ready to talk? You do this for the Eddies? It's like. You know. Depends on what I. Yeah. Did you say you lost your last driver? Can we not talk about it? Yeah, sure, sure. Need a lift to the shop? Nah, I'm good. Get there myself. Sure. Till next time. Till next time. Set up. Hey, V. Thanks for showing. Of course, of course. Talking with Michael is like a game of 3D chess. Don't let her derail you. Care to be a bit more specific? 
Wouldn't mind knowing what to expect. Expect everything. Miss a beat, she'll wrap you around her finger. Get you on her agenda while thinking you're the one in control. Ooh. <laughs> Guess I know the type. I'm ready. Let's go. Hold on. I'll open it. Looks like you've come this way. Easy as bay, yeah. Follow me. Judy Alvarez. I'd say it's great to see you, but I've never been one to lie. Also, I never like surprise parties, but you know. Yep. Bet I even know why. Thought you'd hit rock bottom when you joined the mocks. Guess you've managed to stoop even lower now. Consorting with a persona who is very non grata. Yes, V. I mean you. <laughs> Guess it left a lasting impression. Good. Paid you one visit, and you remember me. My job, among other things, is to remember unsavory customers. Naturally, I take it upon myself to deal with them, too. Now, how am I to deal with you? Don't mind me. That's no... To make sure Judy gets what she came for. Jude would have had a better chance without you. We gotta do something! Or everyone will end up like Evie! Woodman raped her while she was unconscious, then sold her like she was so much scrap. Yeesh, you've always been unstable. Okay, since you seem more reasonable, care to explain what this is about? Judy's idea. Think about it. It could work. Well, well, Jude. See, you found a true and loyal fan. You aware what Woodman did to Evelyn when she was desperate for help? You sit by, let that happen? Tiger Claw bosses rule this place. Know how much I mean to them? About as much as you two and your problems mean to me. Read, negligible. Doesn't it make you wonder why you even work here? Gonna pretend as if you two weren't ever here. For old time's sake, Judy. Literally moments from now, security's gonna figure out you're here. Got two options. Go out the way you came in, or get thrown out. And that's not a threat or figure of speech. Just a friendly heads up. Had enough. I'm leaving. Smart move. And, so you don't think I'm brushing you off completely, Forrest will be on the maintenance level in a couple minutes. Alone. That went smoothly. She totally blew us off! Don't worry. She put on an act. A few days down the line, she'll call and tell you her plan to take over clouds as if it was her idea. You might be onto something. You two have a history. Way back. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. You can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. The line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy what? is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you. I... 
Well, I used to have a big crush on her. It took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. What did the game do? Numbers game. Line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy what? is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. Took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. <sighs> Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. What did the game just do? Not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head. Forget why we're here. Yeah, you, a deck chair, and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella. Somehow I don't see it. I didn't mean to do this. <laughs> what the heck happened? Uh, five, 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 E, nine, B, D. Half the doors aren't working. I just got a load of save. I like the jiggle. That went the jiggle. We just came here. <laughs> totally blew us off. Just put on her at. Don't worry. She put on an act. A few days down the line, she'll call and. Tell your plan to take over clouds as if it was her idea. You might be on to something. Camp almost, Camp almost the Kuwait. You two have a history? Way back, yeah. I think I just felt lonely. Like everyone in Night City. She was different then. So was I. You can't trust people that see everything as a numbers game. Line between patting you on the back as their friend and planting a knife in you as their enemy is down to a decimal. I know. Right there with you, I... Well, used to have a big crush on her. It took me a long time to realize who she really was. But still, honest or crooked, we need her. Just think, could have gone diving this morning. A little unwinding do you good. Do me good too, actually. I wouldn't have been unwinding, not exactly. Got an idea buzzing in my head, working it, but can't say if it'll amount to anything. Yeah, you, a deck chair and a Mai Tai with a cocktail umbrella. 
Somehow I don't see it. No. Me in the deck chairs, me mulling over coulda, shoulda, wouldas. Something I avoid right now. Wait a sec. What about Woodman? No. Well, how's that? Well, what do you want to do? I want somebody to unload lead into his face till there is no face. Somebody? Fine. Want you to do it. Don't have an ounce of sympathy for that motherfucker. So, we go in there? Damn straight. Let's end them. We'll take the elevator. Quickest way. Maintenance level. You know what's worse than a corpo? A wannabe corpo bitch. You mean Maiko? Piece of work, that one. But I'll give her credit. She's dead on about your chances of pulling this off. She fucking call me here. When Evelyn needed help, you raped her. Could have also broken her neck. Hung up her head like a chandelier till it started to rot. <laughs> Instead, I took her to a ripper. Was due a little something in return. She should be grateful. And so should you. Hmm. Here's my token of gratitude. Let's, uh, let's get out of here, V. Shootings have been reported along the water. Punch the ground floor. I'm trying. Eyewitness accounts point to interclan disputes. Almost felt like the world would be a better place once he died. And the feeling? It was so fucking strong. You know. Revenge isn't ever really worth it. People want to believe it'll be the miracle pill for their grief. But that's not how it works. Mm. Gotta get back to Maiko with something big. Appealing to her sense of justice wasn't big enough? Michael only works with specifics. So, what now? Gotta think. We need more bodies, that's for sure. I'll call you when I've got something. See you later, V. And thanks. Job done. What are you doing? I'm perfectly satisfied with my appearance, thank you very much. Would you like Sir, to drive it? please stop. You do fucking what? I could make you a cup of tea. How about sure, groovy green? green? Fuck me, it is awesome. Help! So I I'm hear. being defaced o- You deaf? He asked you to do something. Politely. Chill the fuck out. It's just an SCSM. Please, just leave me alone! Do it for your mother! I know Helen's very worried about you. The fuck? How you know my ma? Be chilled, all right? Brendan didn't mean anything by it. It's not in his nature. How could he mean anything? He's a fucking SCSM, and he's collecting data on my mom. It's called having a memory. It's pretty standard these days. Trying to be smart with me? Why are you defending him? This pile of rust collecting dirt on me for the fucking corpse, yo. Who knows? Maybe you're a corpo agent too. Who the fuck do you work for, huh? <laughs> 
Thank you, V. Boy, I was scared to my core. I thought he'd paint some mean things on me. The humiliation. Say, since we've been through so much together, I guess that makes us best friends. That calls for a discount. Thanks, Brendan. Don't worry. You deserve it. You're one tough cookie. And yet, so nice. Not to everyone. <laughs> I couldn't be mean even if I wanted to. Especially to you. Can't speak ill of the dead, right? Wait, what? You're not supposed to be here. And yet, here you are. Like a glitch in the system. Or a demon coated by a brilliant netrunner. You know what demons are capable of. Right, V? How, how did you know that? Surprised? Lots of people come to me. So, I listen to them and learn how they talk. I caught your name once or twice and pieced together the puzzle. Not bad for a CSM, right? Uh, how about... We'll talk later, all right? Catch you later, Brennan. Just a little more time. Yeah. All ready to go? Hey, V. No, not yet. Carol still needs to check if Militech left any ice in the systems. Corpos haven't shown up in person to report the loss? No, I think we managed to keep them off our scent. We left the trucks with the big Corpo logos down by the Raffin camp. Which was almost as much fun as leaving a bag of flaming dog shit on their doorstep. Fuck, made it look like he just came back from a Corpo War tour. Nice touch. Everything's fine. Clean as a whistle. I always wanted to take one of these suckers for a spin. Which is exactly how all those naive gonks landed at the front. Didn't even need to be recruited. They just showed you the tech. Go on, hop in. Everything is set. All right, let's fire her up. Hold on to your head. Damn it. Anybody get this thing up and running earlier? Maybe you Everything ought to... Everything is dandy. Give me a moment. Not the latest model, but Mitch and Bob did what they could. What do you think? At least now I know why people call them coffins. You steer directly from your seat. All you have to do is jack in. What, no knobs, buttons, blinky doodads? No, none. The impulse runs directly to your cerebral cortex. In a sense, the basilisk becomes an extension of your body. It's like a mystical oneness. 
If it's so mystical and shit, why the co-pilot? Extra support? I'll tell you once we're a bit further from camp. We'll practice. Okay. If you want full functionality in an engagement, you need a second person to handle sensory overload. One pilot steers, the other handles the gun. It's oddly pleasant. You'll see. Okay, this will do fine. A dry run first. I'll disconnect for now. Doesn't need two pilots? You won't be steering and firing. Are you ready? Pan Am, is this, uh, as designed? Neural synchronization doesn't happen at the snap of one's fingers. It'll be over soon. There, see? Okay, starting to understand what you meant. Warm up. Don't worry, I'm not gonna watch. V, do you remember what I said about impulses? Mm hmm. Well, wash out now. What's happening? Hi, Jackton. Our nervous systems are now linked. Right. Basilisk pilots working in harmony. That why I'm feeling everything doubled? It's sensory feedback. Our systems are intertwined. Would you like to try it out? What? Okay. Uh, I could go for that. Found us. We have to get back to camp. Come on, Saul. If I have to leave the clan, please just say so. Spare me another speech of yours at the very least. I'm afraid you'll have to sit through a few more. Because from this day forward, you will lead this family by my side. I will what? I wish to do this properly, but fine. Have it your way. I was wrong. You were right. That's the truth. May it never happen again. But I... I, I made a mess of so many things. You said... I know. But I changed my mind. You risked everything for this family, not even knowing whether you'd be welcome the next day. Okay. Okay. Well, I... Many things will have to change. <laughs> 
Yes. And to start with, we need to leave this place. Quickly. We can't wait for Militech to find us. Of course. I will prepare our route. Congratulations. Terrible choice. I voted nay. Thank you. Thanks. I need to cool down, I think. Will you come with me? Interesting day. I feel as if I barely Sweet. evaded a rapidly approaching train. It's pretty close. I don't know if I could have done it without you. Hey, come on. No, I'm serious. We all owe you. So you can count on the all to count us. Always. Huh. Good to know. Nobody's behind the bar. That I like. Beer? Lemonade? Beer me. To happy endings. What now, boss? I have no idea. I'm serious. Not the faintest. Turns out Saul's all right. So, it's all wrong? I'll play it by ear. V, look around. Look at them. They could be your family. Pan Am, what do you... Stay in camp. Join us. It's really not that simple. You either want to or not. What's so complicated? That's the problem. What I want right now doesn't mean a thing. All right, V. I shouldn't drop bombs like that on you right now. I just thought... Uh, forget about it. I'll think it all over. I pro... V, relax. Everything is okay. How do you feel? What happened? I remember. I... We were talking. Then... Suddenly... You passed out. Completely. We took you with us. Where? Somewhere new. We moved camp. Don't worry, we are safe here. For now. Oh, V. V, you have to tell me what is happening. The blood. You were out for hours. What's wrong? Pan Am, I... It's getting worse. Every single day. Okay, V, relax. Take it bit by bit. What is happening, exactly? You know... Johnny Silverhand. Yes, they sometimes play those oldies on the radio. Why? That's just it. Johnny's alive. He's sitting in my head. He's what? <laughs> am, am I not... Is this some sort of strange metaphor? Long story. Got a job, fucked it up. Now, Silverhand's personality construct's sitting in my head. Bullshit! Yeah, well, he's not too happy about it either. Turns out we don't really mix. And it's getting worse. You are not joking. Just trying to live with it. Survive, actually. It's certainly not doing wonders for your health. 
I gotta go. I'm feeling better, really. Wait, I will go with you. I thought I heard that voice. Hey, Mitch. Finally, we were worried. Took good care of your ride. She's over there. But you're not leaving us already, are you? Is everything okay? So you made yourselves at home already. We do have some experience in this. This is a good place. We have greater control over the area. The rest will settle in quickly. Thanks. I'll stick around for a bit. Make yourself at home. Remember, our offer still stands. If you need help, yell the cop. Then that, at least, we can agree on. If you need anything, you know where to find us. Want me to walk with you? I know this area. Back from the old roots. You really safe here, though? For now, yes. Militech does not venture this far. And our vantage points really are much better. Hey! Welcome back to the land of the living! About time Sleeping Beauty decided to join us. Hey there. But you know, everything here... It is temporary. All of it. We will soon have to decide what comes next. V... Back to what we were saying. I will not even pretend to understand. I don't think it has even sunk in yet. But, I am serious. How can I help? Honestly, not a clue. But there has to be something. Someone who can... Remember Hellman? He's the one who created the personality construct tech. That's why you wanted to get him. But it was a dead end. Now I have to figure out where to go next. You'll find a way. And once you do, let me know. I will help. This whole family will help. Saul was not joking. You understand? Thanks for everything. For being here for me. Take care of yourself. And let me know. Well, just please keep in touch. Alright, that's it for this video. Like and subscribe.